airspace over Srinagar, Jammu and Leh has been shut down indefinitely. Let's go across to Vishnu Som, who's bringing us the latest. Well, the question I have at this stage is that uh, on the basis of an order, like from the Indian Air Force, airspace over, airspace over Srinagar, over Jammu and over Leh has been uh, suspended indefinitely. Uh, and there are reports also elsewhere that suggest that Chandigarh and Amritsar may also be affected directly as a result of uh, this, uh, this ban on the civilian aircraft. Now, what this basically means is that civilian aircraft on the ground in these airports will remain on the ground indefinitely. They will not be allowed to take off. And any aircraft, civilian aircraft, flights, uh, which are inbound to these areas uh, will likely be diverted or, in fact, already been diverted. The information that we have, uh, my sources also indicating that this could be on account of Indian Air Force exercises in these areas. Uh, it's important to put this all in context for us. That entire part of India's airspace, whether it's Srinagar, Jammu, Chandigarh or Amritsar, uh, lies very much in the area of, uh, of potential retaliation from Pakistan on account of India's airstrikes against Jaish targets yesterday morning. Uh, therefore, uh, this area would be on high alert. Uh, it's a complete. It's a known fact that the Indian Air Force is at a very high state of operational preparedness. I should also mention that there are unconfirmed reports of incursions taking place by Pakistani aircraft. We do not have. Uh, we have not been able to independently confirm these reports, but other news agencies are reporting on the basis of their official sources that there may have been some sort of incursion in the Rajori sector or in, in that area by the Pakistan Air Force. Again, um, unless there is a clear-cut explainer, uh, we would refrain from saying anything further on this regard. The third piece of information, and also video now available of a crash which appears to have taken place in Badgam, in Jammu and Kashmir, uh, we are led to believe that this uh, may be an Indian Air Force helicopter uh, that, uh, uh, and that there have been fatalities on account of this crash. Uh, some reports suggesting it's a B-17 V-5 helicopter. There are reports that this could be a fighter aircraft as well. Uh, we do not have any further details on this, but in the case of this crash, there is video which is coming uh, and multiple local reports on the ground. Uh, reporting this, but the, the, again, we are waiting for a statement from the Indian Air Force. So three separate strands this morning.